Hey, what's up guys? My name is Andrew. Welcome back to another video. And it finally happened. Classes have begun. I'm very tired and I just want the semester to be over. And just by looking at the title of this video, I think this is something that I think all college students should really pay attention to. And by looking at the college demographics and my YouTube analytics, I can see that most of my audience is going to be in the traditional college student age range, ranging from 18 to 24. Now before you click off this video, just so you know, you're probably going to be missing out on some pretty substantial stuff that I'm just going to say is free and can benefit every college student. So I suggest you stay and watch this whole video because the reality is most of these colleges are going to offer you free resources and they're probably going to keep it a secret since they want you to pay to take the classes. That way they get the money's worth out of you. Now before you get into the video, leave a like for the YouTube algorithm if you haven't done so already and subscribe if you're new to your channel because 92% of my viewers are not subscribers by the way. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. The first one on this list is Mergent Online by FTSC Russell and this is a British database that offers insights such as CEO salaries to commodities such as egg prices which is pretty excellent for market data. They also offer extensive information on stocks, bonds, ETFs such as financial highlights, annual reports and crazy enough even supply chain which is actually crazy like take Apple for example. To log in, all you need to do is search your college acronym and then add Mergent at the very end of it. For example, I go UT so I searched up UT Mergent on Google and it popped up as the second result on the Google search results page. After that, all you gotta do is log in with your college account credentials. Now for the price of Mergent online, it's about $2,500 a year. But if you're a college student, then it's absolutely free so I would recommend that you take advantage of that. It's definitely one of the best databases if you're looking for market data and financial analytics simply because it's created by FTSC Russell which is a really predominant uh, company. They have their own like market index such as the Russell 2000, 3000, 4000, whatever. But um, it is a really big company so definitely reputable and the information is updated weekly. It's definitely a great option if you're a business student or if you need to research any stocks that you want to invest into and try to look into the financial background. The second one on this list is LinkedIn Learning, also known as Linda. And this is an online library of just different courses and online classes taught by industry experts. They teach you anything from time management to real estate investing to even algorithmic trading. So these are skills that actually matter that will help you get a job in the career that you want to go into. You can also learn at your own pace and they do offer exercise files so you can replicate exactly what the instructor is doing. And once you're done, you can add them to your LinkedIn profile for everyone to see. For me, I've learned some pretty substantial information such as Google SEO, both residential and commercial real estate investments, and how to trade stocks with algorithms. To access LinkedIn learning, all you gotta do is create a login into LinkedIn and then go all the way to the top and then click that little TV icon on the top right corner. Log in with your college credentials and you should be able to access all the online courses. You get access to about 5,000 classes on $30 a month based on the monthly subscription or $240 a year on the yearly subscription. And I did check with all the other universities such as OU and the other UT, but the University of Tennessee and they do have access to LinkedIn Learning, so uh, hopefully your university, whichever college that you go to, does have access to this. The third option on this list is Adobe Creative Cloud, and Adobe is a company that offers industry standard graphic design and animation, such as Photoshop, Illustrator, and my personal favorite, Premiere Pro. These applications are going to be crucial for marketing and graphic design. As for the software, there's not very much bugs, and they do uh, they've honestly perfected um, how the application is built and they do offer updates every few years and even I would consider them a monopoly in the graphic design industry since most graphic designers use uh, Adobe products 
everything that you see from flyers to business cards to um, even posters are going to be built on some sort of Adobe application. As for the cost of these applications, you can get this for about $53 per month based on a monthly subscription, or you can get this for about $600 based on a yearly subscription. And this is pretty expensive, but if you're a university or college student, then you can get this all the way down to $20 per month, which is pretty reasonable since you're getting to access all these applications, over a dozen applications, um, and these are industry standard. So you're getting a really good, reasonable price. And those are really the major resources that I think all colleges should tell you about, but they don't. And if you want access to all of the databases that your university has to offer, uh, just go on Google, search up your college acronym, and then add databases at the very end. And then Google search results should pop up all of the databases based on your search results. Honestly, there are databases on everything you can think of, and there's plenty to choose from. Link down in the description below to get a comprehensive list of all the student discounts. But just to name a few, you can get 50% off Spotify, Showtime, Hulu, 50% uh, off Amazon, 10% off Dairy Queen, free drinks at Chipotle. There's so many to choose from. Again, link down in the description below. So in conclusion, it's kind of concerning how universities and colleges don't tell you about these things. And to be quite frank with you, finding 60% off Adobe Creative Cloud applications is going to be much more useful than taking those University 101 classes that they force you to take. And that sums up the video. Hopefully it wasn't too long, but if you did enjoy the video, leave a like for the YouTube algorithm if you haven't done so already, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And if you want two free stocks on Weeble, link down in the description below, sign up, create an account, and deposit $100 and get two free stocks valued up to $1,400. And I'll see you guys in the next video.